Hey right guys, Trace Much is Joe here, and today we are watching and reacting to episode 3 of Wednesday Season 1. I've just had a shower, so sorry if the pair's a mess, but it needs to dry, unfortunately, and I don't want to wait any longer, because Wednesday... It's a good show, it's a good show. You guys were saying episodes 1 and 2 were the, the, like, the weak episodes, so I'm excited to kind of see how they're the weak episodes and if, if they're the weak episodes and episodes three onwards are even better then i'm gonna be happy i mean to be fair there were like rooms for improvement and stuff so it's not like it couldn't get better uh but yeah i enjoyed episode two a lot more than ep one and we kind of ended with wednesday being kidnapped or something i don't really know what that was about so uh let's find out if you enjoy remember to leave a like if you're new remember to subscribe and if you do want the early and uncut reactions to wednesday then patreon will be linked down below but for now, let's do this. Tied tight enough to cut off circulation. Right. No idea oh, she's being like uh, inaugurated or whatever. It's I don't kind of even party. know. You can take the mask off, Bianca. <laughs> and just like that, my hopes were dashed against the rocks of bitter. Oh, there you go. That's the big reveal, I guess. Then I solved the riddle. Wait, there's a riddle? I thought we just snapped twice. Oh, this guy, this silly Billy. Seriously, turning us down? Can you believe it? Untie her. I freed myself five minutes ago. <laughs> Get wrecked. Do you want a matching black eye? Oh, right, he's the little mermaid dude. Yeah, well, that's... If I'm going to be responsible for Nevermore's demise, the question is, why am I sharing this apocalypse with a pilgrim? A pilgrim? Didn't they all dress up as pilgrims in at one? Those three... Guys. The dedication of a new memorial statue in the town square. <laughs> She's so happy. <laughs> Trust you will all put your best face forward. Yeah. Uh, what? What was that? That was like some horror Doctor Who episode. Uh, what? No, I'm not. Don't make. I don't bond them around. I caught your rooftop serenade the other night. Impressive. <laughs> I volunteered you to accompany the Jericho High School Oh, uh, right. Live concert by Wednesday, let's go. Then I confronted him about it and he kind of went ballistic on me. It's unbelievable! Shut up! up! How can you do that? Oh, yo, he's spitting out his mouth. He is ballistic. Rowan's just a nuisance. Let's just put him down. Jericho's founding father. It's kind of a big deal around here. Yeah, look. Oh, there you go. Yeah, it looks like a fun guy, doesn't it? <laughs> Just find the damn bear and take care of it. Mm. Yes, all right. Everyone take a seat. We have a special announcement. <laughs> wow, that was like Homelander smile. Your generosity and hard work are truly outreaches. <laughs> no, tough crowd. Enjoy! <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, Gwendolyn's got him. What do they do? They just walk around the town? Why would I agree to spend the entire day at some dumpy emporium of Prepple? Because Ajax is going to be volunteering there. Things oh, to be she's spending. got you. You're not interested. No. Oh my god, thank you. You're the best. <laughs> <laughs> Wednesday's a little, uh, Cupid. Wing woman. Pilgrim world. What? You're a pilgrim world, what do you think's gonna happen? She's like, oh god, get me away from this person. Like, well, you're a pilgrim world. It's like going to Disneyland and being confused why Woody wants a photo with you. Well, I am Mistress Arlene, a real OC. Uh, Emily Blunt, it's definitely not, but... <laughs> Travel back in time to the year of our Lord, 1625. Oh, my favourite year. Ye old fudgery. Ye old fudgery? Well, I keep that... in a box. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, pretty much. Yo, Eugene was buzzing. Am I personal fave? Is she the dwarf character from Family Rings of Power? To clan bake. Too cute. I think she's like the wife of Thurin or Durin or Burin or whatever his name is. That is ridiculously oh, big. Check out this greedy little freak. <laughs> Please, I need to get back to the toilet. Mate, there's no way. Oh, Jesus. Why? I'd behead him as well after that. Let him go. No, he just threw up on it. I mean, they were, were going to bully him anyway, so. Really? You're going to try and 1v1 Wednesday? 
You just want to get wrecked again. Mate, that's so embarrassing for you. You try to puff your chest out. Let's get you cleaned up. Yeah, please do. I don't need to look at that. <laughs> She's Nevermore's first normie teacher. <laughs> well, the pleasure's all mine. You're dumb, muggle. Ah, uh, brand new. Before. You said Hummer stick together. I know this might come as a shock, but I don't have any friends. Maybe because you throw up on them all the time, Eugene. What's the big deal anyway? The fudge is definitely the best thing about this place. Stop. Mate, you need to stop talking about fudge. My grandmother once told me, secrets are like zombies. They never truly die. Zombies do die, though, because you just shoot them in the head and it's done. So you... Little bit of... No. <laughs> Future lie in the past. That's the creepiest little wax thing. What is that? I think this is the girl from my vision. Oh, I thought the girl from the vision was just her. That black one she had outside Crackstone's crypt. It was General Tager in the vision, right? I'm sure all the Adams family fans would know exactly who that is. Codex Umbaron. That's Latin for Book of Shadows. Great. It's a fake. <laughs> See? <laughs> Just what the fudge are you doing in here, Missy? Nice. The original was stolen last month during the two o'clock witch trial. It's probably the only authentic thing you have in here. That's not bad though, $50 for that book, off Etsy. Hold thy thong, thy thbong, them krong. I could do that easy. It's not hard. I don't know what all these Shakespearean little fools are on about. Jesus. He's taking homeless to the you? next level. What? Right. See you then. Do you think squirrels and rats... Could ever work out. I mean, okay. they're two totally different species. You have a snake in your head or on your head. I don't know. I didn't imagine that. No, I definitely didn't imagine that. You realize this is like the longest conversation we've ever had. She was counting the words and the time. She's like, there it is, there it is. Longest conversation we've ever had. It's like Sam Gamji leaving the Shire. I mean, it could get on. Ajax, I oh. spent all morning flirting and hinting and trying to act. I was just straight out with it. Roadkill, just so you would ask me on a freaking date. I actually kind of respect that. I kind of respect that. Just get it out there. You want to meet up behind the greenhouse tonight? Yes. <laughs> I actually kind of like him. Yes, I do. Ajax. We have a guy character that isn't too bad. There you go. Because Xavier, Wavier, Bravier, whatever, is, is, he's not doing it for me yet. You were supposed to be at Pilgrim World. You just kind of... I deserted it while my sanity was ...walks so around. Oh, yeah? I'm actually here for Tyler. Told you he was bad news. <laughs> so? Who cares what you think? To is my business. Literally. Bye. You ring? <laughs> God save it. Just cl classic Xavier, am I right? You're really becoming obsessed with this whole monster in the woods thing. Would you rather I develop an obsession with horses and boy bands? Thank you for that. Please, no. Please. Don't tell me you were a Girl Scout. I could eat Girl Scouts for breakfast. Actually, I have an uncle who went to prison for that. Okay. <laughs> Eating people. I want to see that CGI monster again. I want to see if, the, if it looks any better. I was expecting more, too. Um, what was that? Oh, you just, talk to the just the local hobo. We're all right. <laughs> Visions are about as predictable as shark attacks. And there we go. <laughs> nice. That was a sick transition. <laughs> wow. Is that General Tiger? I can't... I'm pretty sure it is. Here he is. You have been judged before God and found guilt. It's like the game Little Hope. Are the true monster, all of you? Wow. <laughs> Talk shit, find out. You know, the olden times were wild. They were just like, yeah, well, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna just throw all these people into a barn and then set fire to the barn. And then if you're a witch, we're gonna prove it by tying rocks around you and throwing you into a river. And if you drown, 
are bad, sorry. Is that what? <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. Sound logic. Set it ablaze! <laughs> that was a great line delivery. <laughs> he may be burning loads of innocents, but that line delivery. That was pretty good. No one really seems to be that bothered to be that. They're just like, yeah. <laughs> no screaming or anything. <laughs> just... Oh, that's depressing. There will be no escape for you. No, get out my face. Her name is Goody Adams. And I believe she's my Goody. ancestor from 400 years ago. Yeah, I'd say so. <laughs> Seeing as you are basically the same person with a different wig. Must have been the bearded man from earlier. Wait for it. Yep. <laughs> I can't tell, I need a full look at it. Monstrous human. Oh. Oh yeah, they turned into footprints. Boom What's him. You saw it? It's here? You the death wish or something? No, nah, Xavier. You are looking suspicious. You were checking out the old meeting house. I guess it's lucky I showed up and I did. Look at him looking around. Like the monstrous human. Its tracks turn from monster prints to human ones. Nah, he's too obvious though. They've made it so obvious. It's Xavier. So it's got to be Eugene or... It's not going to be the guy at the coffee. Nah, I've got nothing. I was trying to learn more about Trackstone. Figure out how he's connected to all of this. Yeah, and you were trying to use your psychic abilities. Well, she did use them, so get right. Something bad is going to happen and I need to stop it. Starting with that monster. Whoever it is. <laughs> yeah, she's got her suspicions. That's good then. Hey, me. Yeah, all right. A monster would say that. Xavier. Ah, oh, dude, I thought it was this song that I was waiting. <laughs> all over TikTok. Oh, I've seen like the scene of her dancing loads as well. That's all over TikTok. Because everyone's recreating it. I don't know what the context of that is or anything, but... <laughs> Wednesday is not bad in. Here we go. And bravo. That is perfection right there. Is that a map? Oh, okay. Nice. <laughs> Timothy Chamelet. Oh, we're getting rid of it. Yeah, nice. <laughs> hey, he did kill her uh, ancestor, so I'm going to say that's fair. Oh, she's popping off now. Now she's vibing. Hey, kill ancestors. This is what happens. She's in her element. Leave her be. <laughs> Wednesday, Adams. Yo, he's melting already. How poor was that metal go? Miss Adams. <laughs> You're already on thin ice. Well, wafer thin ice. I swear on my late scorpion soul. <laughs> clean. Oh, because Thing did it all. Fairs, fairs, I. Isn't she in uh, that Sandman show as well? I never got I never got to that show. You're exhausting. I know. <laughs> well, if you're self aware about it, that's fine. <laughs> My guy was just setting up his camera, what are you doing? Well, that's sad. He was my new favourite character. Oh no. I was going to call him Ian. Too much. <laughs> I, I think there's your answer. Get my mind off that train wreck of an afternoon. I literally think I have PTSD. I mean, I didn't even get to do my Literally. Not a tragedy. Wish me luck. If he breaks your heart, I'll nail gun his. That's fair, that's fair. That, you, so you kind of like Rishi, friend? I don't believe in coincidences. Is he looking for more fudge on trees? Oh, his hair is actually just snakes. Okay. Okay, I thought he just had a snake chilling out in his hair. No. That, what was that? No! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh. Oh, alright, someone the mirror, so he turned himself into stone. Is that him done for life? Rip. Ajax. 
I'd just shower in a room with no mirrors. <laughs> I don't know. I wouldn't run that risk. <laughs> Think you're the one who needs therapy. Well, then all therapists have to have therapy themselves to practice, so her therapist needs to be doing a better job. And sometimes the oh no, she didn't stop up. Well, he did get he did get turned to stone. I promise. As far as excuses go, it's a pretty good one. The music goes hard, goes hard in this show. I do have to admit. Uh, that's the one surprise of this show so far, is that the music slaps. Yeah. Directed by Tim Burton. I'm going to go ahead and assume he directed every single episode then. Which is good, because then that was a consistent... I, I get why not every show can have, like... I think it's two things. Like, not, not every show can have, like, the same director for every episode, because obviously it's a lot of work. It's, like, spreading out that work across multiple directors makes sense. And it keeps things feeling different with different directors so i kind of get it but sometimes when it is like the same director for every episode of the show it's like okay it's just consistent like it's their vision it's done uh so tim burton and then i think so the last of us coming out in jan i think that's a different director every single episode so i'm curious how that's gonna work but uh, yeah i like that this show is just tim burton directing all the episodes so um because you can't recreate tim burton he just he just knows what he's doing and he's smashing it so far. And like I said, the music slaps. Um, editing and acting. All, all, the, all the like technical sides of this so far are really good. Apart from... this Again, CGI is actually great. Just that one month. I need a proper look at it. When I get like a definitive look at this creature, I can decide if it looks like the troll from uh, Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone or worse. Or maybe, maybe better. Maybe better. We'll see. Um... Yeah, this was the best episode. I think we've improved on each episode so far. When uh, Wednesday was going off on the cello when <laughs> the statue was burning, that was great. I like that we kind of had like a different environment. Like we all kind of left the school and went to the town. And we had like Pilgrim World or whatever. And uh, the shop that Enid was kind of in for the day, I thought it was quite good. So some different locations, which was nice. We got sent into a flashback. We learned a bit more about the the backstory of her ancestor i will say like so far each episode i find myself getting more invested in in the main plot as well like ep one i was like okay whatever general take is great <laughs> cool ep two it was more okay the side characters are starting to get a lot better and then ep three i'm like okay i'm starting to get invested in the main plot a bit more now which is good uh, i still don't say i'm like super invested but i'm getting there i'm getting there it's, it's, it's improving each episode so and General Tego again. I know I said that one and two so far, but it just plays Wednesday so well. I have nothing to compare it to with obviously previous uh, recreations, <laughs> previous performances of Wednesday, but I don't know. I, I think everyone's saying like she's incredible, so I'm assuming she's, I won't say better than previous performances, because I, I don't know. I, I don't have anything to, to join you to, but I'm just going off like it's her version of it, and I think it's doing a good job. So yeah, rating, I'll go. Whoop, 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 whoop. Ep 1 was a 7 out of 10. Ep 2 was a 7.7. .7. I'll go 7.9. Very close to an 8. I'm not going to quite give it an 8. It didn't have like 8 out of 10. It didn't have that feel just yet. But it it's very, very close. It's very, very close. Next episode we'll probably get it. Uh, so yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Let me know what you thought of the episode down below in the comments. And if you do want the early and uncut reactions to Wednesday then my Patreon page will be linked down below. There will be one episode ahead, so by the time this one's on YouTube, they should have episode four up. And I'll see you next time tomorrow for episode four. Like I say, make sure to subscribe. You're in one every single day. So until then, take care. Peace.